Alright everyone, thanks for watching my videos again. Alright, today I'm going to do a follow up on uh, where I took apart that computer monitor. And you can see I've uh, desoldered the flyback out of it. I'm going to use it to make a power supply for a Tesla coil. Um, I've also detached this heat sink. So I'm scrapping most of the parts off this you know, circuit board as many as I can. Uh, We'll use this. I'm going to connect it to a. Let me find the transistor. Hold on a second. Uh, this transistor, it's a 2N3055 type transistor. It's an NPN. Um, this is what's going to time the circuit for give it a frequency to be able to put input into the, the flyback. Um, I've also bought a fan for the uh, heat sink and some thermal paste, but I'm going to try to wire this up and I'll show you from there. Alright everyone, I've uh, wired up my flyback. I tried to use that uh, computer monitor tr uh, flyback, but the uh, on the inside of this it's a little different than a TV flyback because they have like capacitors to kind of control the frequencies and all that so it worked for about five minutes but then it just kind of like quit on me so I went out and I found an old flyback out of an old TV and I wired it up with a transistor as you can see um, this is my heat sink that I got out of that you know monitor and I put the fan on there and here's the transistor that I glued to the back with uh, the thermal paste and uh, I wired it up to that uh, to the diagram I'll, I'll show in the video and um, at the end of it and I wired it to these um, big uh, lamp batteries I used a 9 volt battery it works but I get a better result with uh, you know the lamp batteries the lantern batteries that's what it is and I've got a toggle switch turned all on alright I'm going to turn on them I'll show you how it works ok let me move the camera a little bit you see, hold on, I'll zoom it in. Give me two seconds. Okay. I have a disposable camera flash, you know, light at the end of it. And uh, it's pretty good output for a, for a small flyback, but there's a lot of corona. This will be perfect for a, just a mini Tesla coil. Pretty loud. I'm gonna zoom it in and see if I can without it being blurry. Ah. Yeah, don't do this experiment if you don't know what you're doing because uh, high voltage like this can kill you easily. But pretty good, nice, nice output. First time I built one of these. I wish you could see it like in person because uh, like the camera doesn't really pick up everything pretty good I set it up again now I've got the fan running uh, lantern batteries flyback light transistor and some resistors it's a pretty simple setup anybody can do it just some people shouldn't do it because they, they don't know how to be safe, but pretty simple and neat project to do on the weekend. But thanks for watching.